Silliman University is the first ever American university in the Philippines that was established by Presbyterian Board of Foreign Missions led by Dr. David Hibbard. Silliman University has been long known for its high quality education and outstanding academic excellence with the central goal of developing the whole person within the context of a Christian environment. It is a school known for excellence in many fields. Silliman University is one of the leading Christian institutions in the country that is committed to all human development for the welfare of society and of course the environment. The campus revolves around its motto, Via Veritas Vita, for Christ being the way, the truth, and the life. Extending it towards faith, instruction, research, and extension. Along with this are the five C's which offer a variety of avenues for students to learn. The classroom, the court, culture, community, and lastly, the church. Whole person education is at the peak of honing students, molding individuals to acquire development centered on Christian learning. As part of our requirement for general education, we decided to cover Silliman University whole person education. In this video, we interviewed individuals who possess the values, characteristics, and has reflections of whole person in terms of service, character, gratitude, and competence. Sa pila ka tuig nga servisyo ni mo dili sa Siliman, unsa man imo maingon ka bahin ani? Unsa man ilang tabang sa imo ha? Wala man ning sa akong gidugayon diri sa servisyo. Kita ko na kung Siliman nga pasila sa tabang. Sa mga benefits ang kuha na mo para sa mga pud lang gihatag sa mga yun. Para gud sa inyo ha kuya. Oh, kaya kami na. Oh, karon nga pandemic kuya, unsa man ilang natabang pod sa imo ha? Para lang agad mi like mga one. Mga one ng grocery, kaning uh -huh. 25 kilos of rice. Uh -huh. so, Manay lang ihatag ron kung pandemic. Uh -huh. I am April Nicole Tumapang. I am a second year AB Political Science student and at present I am the chairperson of the SUSG Special Projects Committee, external PRO of the CAS Council, and external PRO of the top social civic organization in Siliman University, Ang Sandigan. You mentioned that you have those positions, so how are you able to apply it to the needs of the community in terms of service learning? So, um, at first I really started in a small position. I was just a member, but seeing, um, join, but seeing the organizations that I joined serving the community, I once told myself I wanted to be like them. And then, siguro as time passed by, I told myself na, ah, let me try this thing. So, I tried volunteering. At first, um, as far as I could remember, I was assigned for communication. So, I had to do all the secretariat work. I thought it was very easy at first since you were just going to draft letters. But then, it wasn't since you were to communicate with the, um, for example, sponsors, volunteers, and... Uh, other people who are also involved and then I think that it really molded me to see uh, a better perspective in the community that not only to see the surface but also to see uh, deep inside it and I think that what that's what molded me uh, into a better individual seeing the situations especially now uh, when the typhoon Odette hit um, Negros Oriental, I can really see that a lot of people, um, uh, let's say for example, kana naginahanglan, because I can see since I also volunteered for Rotaract Club of Dumagate, and then I can really see a lot of people naga suffer karon 
because they don't have electricity they don't have water they don't have shelter and some people also lost um, family members so it really opened my perspective uh, to see the community um, not only on the surface okay. okay thank you for that to what extent did the institution mold you as someone who values leadership and service okay so i started out my service um i didn't start as a leader again i started out as a member and then the influence of the people i have been with as what i have said kanina na, okay i want to be like them and then uh, maybe it's one of um, the biggest opportunities that i received during college because i wasn't active during my senior high school years i was only active uh, starting from first year so a lot of opportunities were given to me and that's what how i value leadership uh, i have a lot of kumbaga idol when it comes to leadership uh, like the people i work in sg they are really competent the people i work in my inside and outside organizations i can learn a lot from them Indeed, whole person education in Silliman University integrates various learning experiences with goals towards developing a Silimanian to be a creative critical thinker, effective communicator, transformative Christian witness, independent, and lifelong reflective learner. WPE goes beyond the four corners of the classroom extending our reach as students. It builds bridges from the campus to the community, extending our learning and sharing our knowledge with others. Rather than focusing on the intellectual aspect or a few of the other aspects, it is indispensable to consider all aspects of development to develop the whole person and eventually reach success through Silliman University.